This tutorial is powered by AskQuesty.com. Get help with your website on demand. And don't forget, subscribe for more tutorials. How to apply expires headers to WordPress. So first off, what is an expire header? So on this blog, it says, what are expire headers? Expires headers tells the browser to request a specific file from the server or download it from the browser's cache. And then they not only reduce a load, load, a load of downloads from the server, but also decrease the number of HTTP requests from the server. So they serve the previous version of the same file from browser cache rather than loading from the server. So essentially they're saying, if you visit the website for the first time, it'll take a little longer because it's gonna have to download and keep all these images and stuff. But the second time you load it, if you have an exp if you have expires headers, it'll load the image from your cache, which is on your computer, rather than to fetch it from a server, which takes more time. Okay, so okay, so the way you apply ex uh, expires headers to WordPress is you navigate to your WordPress, okay, inside your WordPress dashboard. Okay, make sure you're logged in, and then head over to plugins and you want to install the plugin that is called Far Future Expiration Plugin. Okay, so the way you do that is you go into Add New and search for um, expires head, expiry header, or, okay. And you wanna look for this plugin called Far Future Expiry Header. Click Install Now. And then after it is done installing, click activate. And for after it is activated inside of plugins, you will, you should see the far future expiry plugin that looks like this. And to use this plugin, simply go to settings and scroll down to the bottom where it says far future expiry and click on it. And here you can, um, you can enable the far future expiry by checking this box and also checking the files that you want to load from cache. So in this, in, in my case, originally this was how it looked. All right. This was how it looked. Nothing is loaded from cache. So when I did a web page test on this, it took four, uh, 4.869 seconds to load the website. Okay. Now this is not so great. It's serving an F for cache static content, which means it's not um, best utilizing the, the cache, right? So when I check the enable for future expiry and set this thing to, for a number of days to seven, and then I decided to load these images from cache, and then I click the save button, what happened is when I did the web page test, it change the loading time from around four four to five seconds to about uh, one one point six three five seconds so much faster as you can see in general you want to keep your web page loading time under three seconds Th uh, that way Google SEO treats your website better and can rank it higher so anyway that is how you apply expires header to WordPress. Thanks for watching. If this was helpful, please subscribe. And if you need extra help, visit askquesty.com and send us your questions.